Let's do a spike leaf film. Yeah, that sounds fun, right? So there's a, if you go into certain bargain stores, some of the few that still have media in them. There's a bin of $5 movies. And now even Blu-ray is in that $5 bin. But there's also a really cheap bin, 374 bin. I find that bin mo better. Because I found this inside that bin. Denzel Washington and Spike Lee and Samuel Jackson. Um, so, uh, for some reason, I, I, I guess I always thought this was based on a true story. It seems that not, not, well, I mean, it's got uh, music by Billy, who is, you know, Spike's dad, so it's, it's somewhat personal. Uh, but the, uh, the character that Denzel Washington is playing is not true. Not exactly. I don't know. <laughs> uh, but if you want to see uh, Samuel Jackson beat up Spike Lee, this is the film for you. Because that's what he's going to do. He doesn't have much more of a part in it. He barely has a word in the film. But, uh, it's pretty fun to be able to beat up your director. That's that's actually a pretty uh, that's a choice role. Um, so uh, the only thing really to say about the film, uh, Spike Lee is no stranger to controversy, and I'm gonna agree with him completely on this one though. Uh, he he was called out for his portrayal of Jewish people, Jewish managers, um, people he's probably actually met. Uh, and I noticed that, that happens a lot in Hollywood, uh, completely, is like, hey, what are you doing? Um, and Spike was like, did you know I'm black? Do you know how long a history we've had with... I mean, because they were calling him out saying, Hey, Spike Lee, you want all this, you know... You want it to be all even and stuff and to make a fair, you know, representation of black people. Yeah, but it hasn't been that way. And if you see it wrong, well, then go backwards and look at everything that's happened previous to what I'm trying to accomplish here. If you don't like it, that's your fault because you let it happen forever, you know? So I agree with that. Good job. And, uh, you know, that that may have been the one of the better things to come out of the film. It's, it's actually well-received. Uh, I didn't find it very exciting. I mean, the whole thing is he's kind of... Denzel Washington is between two ladies and, you know, obsessed with his music and what, and as well, and... Trying to just make the right decisions with a manager who is not the right manager, but you know it's it's his friend as well, and I I guess that's with every artist, everybody who comes up and goes, oh I've made it, and your friends are like, hey man you made it, you gonna bring us with you right? Hmm. And you want to, and you try, and maybe you do, and maybe you just say, well, there's a lot of money, and yeah, everybody can be a part of my entourage, and then they eat it all up, and then you're totally screwed, and they, and then where are they, you know, when, when you're gone, so watch out for that when you're famous, okay? All right, that's, okay. Spike Lee, there we go.